Uh, Tim, one of the first things that people want to set up when they are building a truck for going off-road is a dual battery system. Yep. Or an auxiliary battery system. It's pretty important if you're running fridges and things like that. You don't want to kill your starter battery. For sure. That's right. Now, I used to think that you just stuck an extra battery in and plugged everything into it, but it's not quite that simple, is it? No, it's not. And there's, uh, there's quite a few disadvantages of just adding another battery like that. It is far better to have some, so some way of isolating that battery. Yep. So what Red Arc has, we have one fitted here. It's our SBI-12, the smart battery isolator yep. for the 12 volt system. So I've got one here out of the box here. So essentially, you can see here we've got two connections and you've got one battery on this side, one battery on this side, and it will be joining those two batteries together. When you like start- all the time. That's right. So what you want to be, have it so that when you're running the engine, it will click it in. And we have an electronic circuit board on the front here. With that electronic circuit board, it's sensing the voltage. As you run the vehicle, it'll see that voltage come up and we'll click in and join those two batteries. So thereby charging the auxiliary battery. Yep. When you turn your engine off, that voltage will fall. It'll sense again with that circuit board and disconnect the two batteries, thereby isolating them. Hence the smart battery isolator. Yep. So when you run your fridge for three days straight to keep your beer cold and kill that battery, you can still start your car. That's correct, yes. Your start battery has been isolated, so you're able to restart your car. This will then click in again and start charging that auxiliary battery and hopefully cool those beers. Yeah, pretty important work. I, I'm amazed at how compact this is, considering what it does. I mean, there's lots of battery chargers out there, but this thing, you can put it anywhere, even in the most crowded bonnet. That's right. And at Red Arc, we are aware that space is certainly an issue under the bonnet, so it is very compact. Uh, there is an additional feature too, uh, with this blue wire, and you're able to actually jumpstart yourself. Okay. So that means that should your start battery go flat, perhaps you've left the door open or someone's been listening to the radio all night, yep. then you can actually click it in and able to start off your auxiliary battery. Okay, so that's just like a temporary bridge that you can override. That's right. Mate, that's much better than uh, having to ask you, mate, for a jump every time we do something stupid. It sure is, yes, yes. Save that stupidity and uh, jumpstart yourself. Yeah.